What 6 foot 9 inch center Dave Cohen's lacked in size he made up for with an aggressive, all encompassing desire to win. Cohen's went full throttle from the opening tip and played every game with great passion. Rather than follow the traditional notion of a basketball center as a back to the basket pivot man, Cohen's roamed the outside, shooting soft jumpers or driving to the basket. The Big Redeed began playing basketball his junior year in high school, but he still managed to earn a scholarship to Florida State University, where he averaged a double-double in points and rebounds. Although criticized for being too small to play center, when Cohen's shared the NBA Rookie of the Year award with Portland's Jeff Petrie in 1971, he quickly silenced any doubters. He averaged a double-double in points and rebounds for his career despite facing opposing centers that physically dwarfed him. Cohen's was a key member of the Boston Celtics 1974 and 1976 NBA championship teams. In 1970-71, Cohen's was named the co-NBA Rookie of the Year with Jeff Petrie of the Portland Trailblazers. In his first year, with the Celtics, Dave averaged 17.0 points per game, 15.0 rebounds per game, and 2.8 assists per game. During his 11-year NBA career, Cohen's was an NBA All-Star eight times. In 1973 he was selected the All-Star Game Most Valuable Player. Achieving the ultimate individual goal, Dave was named the 1972-73 NBA Most Valuable Player. Cohen's helped lead the Boston Celtics to two NBA championships in 1974 and 1976. Others on those two squads included Hall of Famers Jojo White and John Havlicek as well as Paul Silas and Don Nelson. Dave was selected to the All-NBA second team three times. He also made the NBA All-Defensive first team once and the NBA All-Defensive second team twice. Dave started playing basketball when he was a junior in high school. With relatively little experience, he was able to earn a scholarship from Florida State University. As a Seminole, Cohen's averaged a double-double in points and rebounds during his college career. The Boston Celtics chose Cohen's with the fourth overall pick in the 1970 NBA draft, following Bob Lanier, Rudy Timjanovic, and Pete Maravich. The Celtics needed a new center since the great Bill Russell had retired in 1969. Cohen's retired following the 1979-80 season having played one year with new Celtic legend in the making Larry Bird. Two years later, at the request of friend, former teammate, and Milwaukee Bucks coach Don Nelson, Dave returned to the league for 40 games with the Bucks during the 1982-83 season. Dave finished his NBA career with averages of 17.6 points, 13.6 rebounds, and 3.8 rebounds per game. In 1996, Cohen's was honored as one of the 50 greatest players in NBA history. Cohen's number 18 jersey was retired by the Boston Celtics on February 8, 1981.